I want to talk about wedging the foot for stretching the underside of the foot, so the plantar surface of the foot. So if I want to rock the heel forward, I can place a wedge at the back of the foot to rock the calcaneus in a full position. And then from there, I can put the front of the foot into a slightly dorsiflex posture. So from there, I just naturally created a bit more length on the underside of the foot. And then if I go through single leg exercises like foot circles or like hip hinges, then from there I just feel like I'm getting much more stretch on the plantar surface of the foot. So it's a really great way to wake up the foot muscles and the, the muscles on the underside of the foot, just to try and get a little bit more mobility through those tissues. Um, and you can wedge at slightly different angles as well, but first I would just suggest a front and back wedge.